Hey, morning. I'll also talk a little bit about my daily routine. So I tend to run my day from about 5 a.m. to 9 p.m. and trying to get 16 hours worth of useful time. So first thing in the morning is really focused on things like meditation, prayer, um, checking my finances and my business interests, uh, getting housework done and always getting out for exercise. Then when my kids are up, it's really some family time. So seeing the kids, my wife, um, getting work started, and then through from, you know, 7.30ish to maybe 6pm, it's time for my work, my employment work. And I may have a bit more time to do other little things on the side, like content creation or any kind of um, exceptional business meetings. And then when you get to the evening, that's really more focused on family time, always have family dinner, um, seeing my wife, any admin I didn't get done in the day. And then it's just like really um, focused, progressive work. It might be reading, um, it might be something technology related. Um, it's usually something that has got a focus on um, developing myself, developing my businesses, um, connecting with people that I wouldn't normally get the chance to connect with uh, during, during the regular day. Um, I also have an arrangement whereby I do not do my employment work on a Monday. So I effectively have Monday, which lets me explore um, other business interests. Uh, it lets me focus a lot more on things like family time. So with my wife, with the baby, um, I can do longer bouts of physical activity, all that kind of thing. So that really fits in there as well. You know, the, the way I look at um, a day, 24 hours is rather than thinking about nine to five, which is really just a pretty limited eight hour focus. If you just flip it and focus from five to nine, then you're straight away, you've actually doubled your day. Like straight away, you're looking at how to work through 16 hours. And if you're pretty focused, I don't even think you have to be that good at anything, but I think if you're just like pretty focused, you can do an awful lot more um, in that time than, than you could even imagine. Like I've found there have been times where, for example, if I really wanted to do something, I don't know, meaty, like, you know, read a particularly long book or go for a particularly long run or do something like build a website or something, you know, when you wake up at between four and five o'clock and you just get some water in your system, a bit of a breakfast and you crack on, like you can really power through a lot of the work that previously took a much longer time to complete and you're doing it totally undistracted. Or if there's something for your employment and you, again, work that through in the morning, you can often find that before people have even turned up for work, you've got the job done. And then the rest of the time you can spend doing something more constructive. Um, I think as I've just gotten older, I've just realised a little bit more about um, my useful time and my productive time is so much based on managing my energy properly. And when you're up in the morning, there's a special energy that you get from nature like right now you can hear birds, there's no distraction. Um, I think there's a special energy that you get from doing difficult things. And then there's this really special energy that you get from achievement. So I feel like you can unlock a lot more of that in the morning, undistracted, just working through um, whatever it is you wanna focus on. And then, you know, you've got the rest of the day to kind of just get on with other things. And that kind of balance um, to me, certainly offers a lot more in terms of my personal achievement and I found myself to be a lot more successful with that.